So Tyler Root, he's a professional Hearthstone player. Came up with this Mecha Zoom deck that comes with a giant anaconda. anaconda ah, this guy's toast. I found this to be interesting because it's much easier to empty your hand when you don't have to run excessive amount of cards, right? Because Stampeding Roar is essentially Anaconda, which is essentially Mechathune, right? So instead of having to get rid of two non Mechathune cards, you combine it into the Mechathune. Because this and this and this, they're essentially just the one Mechathune for six mana. I found that to be an interesting um, concept. Because sometimes the problem with Mechathune is that you run cards like Spreading Plague. And with Spreading Plague is you have a hard time killing your own units. But when you combine Stampeding Roar, which is just playing Anaconda, which is just playing Mechathune, you also have the ability of 4 extra mana. 4 mana that you can use to play other cards. So the concept is very, very intriguing. What a concept this says! I wonder if it'll work for her car. No, because of Togwaggle. So it's either you kill Anaconda with a uh, 3 damage spell, or your opponent just having a minion with 3 attack. Because Stampeding Roar gives a rush, right? A-N-A-C-O-N-D-A My Anaconda don't... My Anaconda don't... My Anaconda don't... What? No, it's... Buns, hunt. So Cobra has to die for the effect, which is why I said as long as your opponent has 3 attack, you can just trade off because it comes with rush. Also, you have wrath. Also, you have spells still. Floop's glorious gloop. Not very useful unless you're up against aggro. Priest is difficult because I'll scream. Yeah, Priest players generally lack the IQ to do that. But I do agree, scream is the one thing that makes Mechathune. A little more difficult, but it usually just delays their death by one turn. This will be good. Whoops, I forgot to attack. Yeah, it's wall priest, damn it. Dang it! Wall priest is annoying because even this little tar creeper has the potential to just end my whole career. I'll say wall priest is probably one of the worst matchups here. Cycle. We got two auction years. Another annoying thing for Mechathune Druid to kill is the two auction years. It requires a smart opponent to see that. Do you guys know about the bounty board on Twitch? So there's like a listing of sponsorship you can just take and it's like automatically processed for you. Not sure if other streamers talk about it. It's pretty interesting. It's just there and you click. I would like to do the sponsorship. The problem is the payout they offer is based on your regular viewership, which for me is Hearthstone. So it says, Let's see. you'll get $5,000 if you retain 10,000 viewers playing our shitty game. If you do not hit 10,000 viewers playing this, we will give you only a portion of the payout. And it's like, now, dude, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not getting ten thousand dollars per hour playing your Clash of Clans minion ripoff. Unfortunately, this guy's gonna kill me, man. Like, I think I go for armor actually. Mmm, he's not playing anything. Shit, this guy's doing me a monk S. I got the best deals anywhere. A huge monk S. Oh god, this card these cards suck. Oh, that card sucks too. What's with all the sucking? Calm down, Toast, calm down. Easy lad, easy.
We've reached safe harbor. Time goes short. That's annoying. Not getting any of my spell still. As I draw one trillion armor worth of stuff. This will be good. Yeah, both spell stones at the bottom. That's gonna be annoying a little bit because of the whole kill, have to kill my own anaconda. If he plays Mogushan boy, I might have to naturalize it. I just need to save one naturalize. That's it for my own mecha soon. That's the beauty of the cobra. Oh, okay, that's fine. That eats up his entire turn. So, like, we're okay with that. Eh, gain some armor, I guess. Don't want to overdraw here, right? Ah, there he is. When you get rid of an Acolyte, a Wild Pyro, and an Auctioneer without dying. One Spellstone should be safe for a Giant Anaconda, but we don't need, need it if we just run into his face. Divine him. Alright, I gotta use a Spellstone here now. Why don't we want to overdraw? Because right now, our difficulty is spending our card. If we overdraw too much, we'll fatigue a little faster. Also, we want to keep second spell stone if we can. I'm not saying it's not the Let's worst see. thing to do. <laughs> Time to pay. Because I feel like if we want draw, we'll always get draw anyway. Especially with an acolyte left on the board. Maybe we can draw a little faster. We do this. And then we naturally draw the remainder three cards. Yeah, I can see that being. Yeah, I do have another auction here. That's the thing. <laughs> Time to pay. Time goes short. <laughs> like this will draw me a card. Next card turn will draw me a card. I have to play this still. I have to play wild pile still. Ah, uh, one's fine. I'm worried if he just ignores this, but you know, worst case scenario, I just naturalize it myself. Hmm. This is such a cool concept. I never thought about it. By reduce, by increasing the number of cards Mechatune represents, it's much easier to empty your hand. Like that's okay. It's a very interesting concept. It is. Yeah, auction in hand. Small part in hand. So that's both Psychic Scream gone, right? I can naturalize. I'm thinking if I leave this up, there's no way he Omega, Omega OTK me. Divine 10, Divine 20, Divine 40. That's like, that's, that's, that's an impressive amount of uh, Divine Spirits. I kind of want to keep Spellstone just in case. I don't want to just trot it out. Oh, that's fine. What are you doing, you mouth? Thank you. So mana wise, six, seven, eight, nine, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Hmm, thinking emoji. This is fine. Ooh, that's a topsy mill. Is someone injured? Onward, friends! Well, Gavna! 
looks like we got a win. We do. <laughs> Time to pay. Do I play Stampeding Roar here? Boppets and Crumpets. Huh. This is such a refinement on the existing druid mecha still. Wall Priest is supposed to counter us. What an interesting concept. Why is this any better? Because your mecha soon now represents... Not only is your mecha soon 4 mana cheaper, it also represents 3 cards. Which is a good thing when you have to use up every single card, right? So you save 4 mana and you spend an extra 2 card. Which is a, a significant improvement. That's definitely better. Lights out.